what's up? What is up, man? Anyway, the guy in the truck's like, what, is, what the hell is wrong with that guy? It's a, a shirt, and it's got that on there. So, uh, yeah, just to keep cooler in Arizona, I got a tank top. to a friend of mine, I won't mention names to protect the uninnocent, um, and, uh, you know, in uh, tube mail, and uh, this, this friend of mine happens to have a 250, and um, he uh, was telling me about a dream he had. Uh, fireworks! Yay! Um, it was a dream he had about being on his Ninja 250 and uh, he had gotten some ice cream uh, and he went riding off with the ice cream. He didn't eat it at the place he got it. He actually went riding off with it. And <laughs> while he's riding, of course, he ends up spilling the ice cream on the Ninja and then he wakes up. So, I immediately was like, and I, I want to know everybody's opinion here. Um, you know, I love my bike too, but ice cream on the on the bike, cream on the bike, and you're asleep. I don't know how many of you are psych students out there, but uh, to me that says that you really love your bike. Really, really, really. You know, and keep in mind this was a guy, so it was. It might have been one of those special dreams. If you, you know what I'm saying. One of those special guy dreams. Uh, <laughs> and uh, he creamed on the ninja. Ice cream, I mean. Yeah. Hmm. I I'm just, uh, just going to leave that alone and let you all ponder this in your own thoughts, in your own time, in the peace and quiet of your own home. Thank you. Thank you very much for joining us for uh, Motorcycle Psychology 101. Oh, I see a cop hiding there. Oh, bacon. It's bacon. Uh-oh, I need gas. It's bacon.